Hello everyone, this is Ahmed Don. Today I'll show you how to pack a carry-on for 3 to 4 days travel. Now I'm holding uh, my camera with one hand and using my other hand so uh, there the video may not be that uh, smooth. Uh, sorry about that. So before even I start I'd like to mention that uh, different airlines have different carry-on requirements and in general your carry-on luggage which I have it right here should be below 22 inch and your personal item should be below 18 inch and then you can also carry or keep another bag but the secret is uh, this is kind of another like you know uh, bag which you can keep as a um, third bag uh, and you have to you should be uh, you know attaching it to your waist not wear it as a sling bag uh, so that way airline wouldn't consider that as a uh, personal item so if you wear this as a sling bag, the bag then they're going to consider this as a personal item and then uh, they might give you trouble so that's how you can actually carry three uh, bags with you even if you're taking only carry on now these are what i'm going to be wearing so just a polo shirt a, a white pants and a socks so i'm just going to set this aside uh, i'm showing you this just to give you an idea that you know how much stuff i'm going to be taking with me for three to four days of travel so I'll just you know uh, set this aside here so now let's uh, look at the uh, personal item so you can see that I had the option to take much bigger than this but the reason I'm taking only this small size personal item because I don't need bigger than this so I'm just going to be keeping my uh, laptop in here and this is a, like in you know, a mini laptop it's like 10.5 inch and then I'm going to be keeping some other you know necessary items in here it's not nothing going to be like you know too much and then in my um, third bag which is I'm going to be wearing uh, on my waist however once I you know go through the like you know uh, once once I'm inside the plane then I'm go going to be I can wear this as a sling bed uh, it should be okay but you know when you're going through the counter or the uh, before entering the like you know uh, airplane uh, do not wear this as a sling bed they might give you trouble so in here I'm going to keep like you know uh, credit cards and then like you know uh, ca a small camera and stuff like that not uh, nothing uh, not too many now this is going to be my main uh, carry-on and the, it has an outer compartment and here i'm going to be keeping those items i need to take it out for security checking so you can see that these are like you know liquids everything under 100 ml uh, and these are going to go out to put on the security uh, bin and if i need another or anything else like in a quick item then I can put it in here so I'm just going to open this here and then here the thing is I'm a content creator so 50% of my items actually they are like you know related to uh, videography and photography so if you're not a content creator you can just cut everything in half so basically you are you can even travel with like you know half of this uh, so you can see that you know uh, I have lots of like you know camera and accessories and still I managed to put everything in one carry-on and travel with one carry-on so for example here I have like you know uh, some items for uh, computer and uh, camera so I'm just going to set it aside and then here I have some like you know uh, chargers and uh, power bank and uh, batteries uh, put it aside and then here I have just like you know USB uh, uh, actually this is SSD memory card uh, so this is also like you know it's not uh, too big you can see this this is like a very small two terabyte memory card and I'll just put it here and here I have a pair of sandals so you're going to be needing this uh, because you know some hotels they do not provide sandals and if you want to just walk outside the hotel then it's always good to keep a pair of sandals and this might look weird but uh, this is a duct tape and this things comes in handy uh, when you're traveling uh, like you know there are times when you may not may need to like you know uh, put something together or tie something together so this is a very handy piece uh, which I would always keep whenever I'm traveling so I'll just put it in here and then here this is my uh, kind of like in you know, a razor toothbrush uh, I have this in here so let me just show you very quickly so you can see that like you know I have my uh, razor uh, and then floss and then uh, toothbrush which is uh, right here and then let me just put it in here and then here again uh, these items are for camera and accessories so if you're not a content creator actually you don't even uh, need to have these things so these are all like you know related to camera and uh, 
content creation. Now I have again same here. And this is like you know mic, uh, wind muff, and stuff like that. So this is also related to content creation. And uh, here again I have like you know two mini. Uh, tripods uh, this is also related to content creation so you can see that most of my items are related to like you know YouTube or videography so if you are not into those your carry-on should be really very lightweight so here this is my like you know main compartment for uh, clothing and you can see that I have only one piece of like you know uh, PJ and then one uh, pair of uh, pants and then the pants I showed you before, that's what I'm going to be wearing. So basically I'm traveling with only two pairs of pants and uh, I'm going to be washing them whenever I need. So that way I don't have to carry too much. And then here you can see that I have a like, you know, a merino uh, old t-shirt, which can be worn like, you know, many days without washing. And then I have a regular uh, cotton t-shirt, which is right here. And then I have uh, one pair of socks and uh, another like, you know, underwear and travel a uh, small travel towel so basically these are the all items and I'm going to be traveling with and another thing I have a uh, this is a portable uh, monitor and uh, this is very lightweight and very small and I'm going to be just like you know putting it in the uh, compartment uh, which is right here you can see that this is right here and then this can be attached to the small laptop I showed you, uh, which is good enough for my travel to like, you know, edit video. So that way I don't have to carry like, you know, big laptop or bulky laptop. So basically these are all items I'm, I'm going to be uh, traveling with. And you can see that, you know, imagine uh, if I didn't have uh, video creation or anything, then my items would be very like, you know, negligible and very lightweight. And even with all these like, you know, items, which are mainly for video, uh, and for the purposes, I managed to travel with the carry-on. So, what in, uh, I suggest you do that you know don't don't just rely on the sizes, uh, watching video or listening to other people. Always check with the specific airline you're taking for your specific carry-on size. So, for example, in general, they're like in you know, a 22-inch carry-on. Uh, under 18 inch personal item and this one is kind of like an you can sneaking if you're wearing as a waist uh, bag but do not wear as a sling bag uh, and also basically these are what I'm going to be uh, traveling with and uh, I'm hoping to do more this type of video in the future uh, to show what what you know I carry uh, in my carry-on bag and I have a trip coming up after this trip which is going to be one month in the Philippines and I'm going to show you again that time uh, from Philippines that you know what I'm carrying with me at that time so for the next tips and tricks video I'm going to put a link on the screen and I'll see you in the next video thank you for watching